Ever wondered if the styrofoam you usually throw away could actually turn into a material as strong as stone? Today, we're going to mix styrofoam, gasoline, and cement, simple materials that will give you surprising results. Let's get started. A simple home experiment with results that are anything but simple. The next step is to pour gasoline into the container, then dissolve the styrofoam in the container. Finally, the styrofoam will melt into liquid. We cut the styrofoam into small pieces to make it easier to put it into the container. Once all the ingredients begin to combine, the texture becomes even more unique. Stir gently until the mixture feels even and firm. This process requires patience, but this is where the magic begins. From a light and crumbly material, it slowly transforms into a sturdy dough ready to be shaped. It begins to resemble small, dense, and hard building materials when dry. From here, we can create many things, from molds to decorations to materials for future experiments. It's simple, yet inspiring, as creativity knows no bounds. Now, we pour the mixed ingredients into the bucket. At this point, the texture begins to change, thicker and denser than before. From here, we can see that this simple combination is starting to form something new. The color and structure begin to resemble building material dough, but with a unique character resulting from the experiment. Once the mixture is ready, let's try applying it to the cracked wall. Slowly apply it evenly following the cracks. The texture is quite malleable and adheres well to the surface. We slowly smooth the surface for a neater result. Use gentle movements, just enough to close the gaps and match the texture to the surrounding wall. Little by little, the previously visible cracks began to close completely. Now all we have to do is wait for it to dry completely. This process does take a little time, but the end result is worth it. When completely dry, the surface will be harder and will adhere firmly to the wall. Now let's move on to the part of the wall that has a hole in it caused by the water pipe. This part does need to be drilled, but it often becomes a gap through which rainwater enters the house. Well, the material we made earlier can be a simple solution to seal this gap. Gently apply it around the pipe ensuring all sides are tightly sealed to prevent water from seeping in. Once finished, the finish looks neater and is completely sealed, ready to protect the wall from rainwater splashes. One small step, but a very important one to keep your house dry and clean. Once dry, the results were absolutely immaculate. The cracks in the wall were now completely sealed and the surface was smooth. When water was poured on, it flowed down like a taro leaf. No leaks, no gaps. Simple, but the results were satisfying. From simple materials, it turns out you can create powerful and useful solutions at home. Proof that creativity doesn't require expensive equipment. All you need is a willingness to try. Thanks for watching. I hope this experiment inspires you at home. See you in the next DIY project.